What's up, guys? This is Daniel uh, with Smoky Point Distributing. Um, I have a driver on the phone. Um, I will let him go ahead and introduce himself, and we're going to talk a little bit and see how things are going. And are you there, Mike? Yes. All this right. is Michael Robinson, and I've been with SPD for almost three years. Wow, almost three years. Man, what what is your opinion on Smoky Point SPD, and why did you come over to this company? Well, one reason I came over is because of you. Yes. At first, I didn't want to come over here, to be honest, because um, I thought it was going to be too good to be true, you know, how companies are sometimes. Anyway, uh, but I got to watching your videos, and that's what made me come over here. So I thought, well, I'll give it a try. So I came over and it's the best thing that's ever happened in my life for me and my family. Nice. Well, first off, thanks for watching my videos. Um, it, it was hard to believe everything that I was saying in my videos about the culture of the company and the pay and everything until you actually get over here and experience, um, what SPD is like because we're not a mega carrier or we, we're not a small company either. Where, where would you categorize SPD? As for, uh, just the feel, what do you mean, overall like, feel of the company. Um, is it, is it, does it have the family feel to it or does it have like the mega carrier feel to it where you're not really taking no care it's of. actually like everybody knows you i mean when you come to work for spd everybody knows you it's not a number they're not calling you by number they don't know who you are they do know who you are and what i like about them is they're good to their drivers they're always good and uh anytime i have an issue i just call them and they're willing to talk to me and let me know what's going on and what we could do. Like if I have to get home and all that, they're always there for their drivers always. And they have nice equipment. They don't give you junk. And, uh, what else can I say? I mean, they're just amazing. I absolutely agree with you. Um, or how long are you planning on staying with the company? Or have you yes. looked? Have you thought about leaving? Now, see, to be honest, I left for a little bit. It was the worst mistake in my life when I left because I just went under after that. I mean, me and my wife almost lost everything we own because I left. Because I was going to local. It wasn't nothing the company did to me or nothing like that. I was going to do local. But it just, it didn't turn out the way it's supposed to, and which hardly ever does. So I just came back. My, I, I told my wife, I said, you know what? I was on the truck with a different company and doing local. And I just told my wife, I can't do this no more. She goes, yeah, you need to go back to SPD. I've definitely. But I wasn't there. gone that long. I haven't, I wasn't gone that long. But you're so yeah. You, you and your family's doing good now, right? Oh yeah, we're doing good. awesome. This company is great. I mean, see, for example, with this other company that I was with, local or regional, whatever you want to call it, uh, I was broke. We were broke. My wife, I mean, my daughter is into motocross racing, and now I finally got. Able when I came back to SPD, I got her all of her equipment, her bike, and all that stuff. So I'm doing great, and I I couldn't ask for a better company. Good. I just made a bad choice on leaving, which I should have never did, which I regret. And I'm not going to ever leave. I'll retire from these guys. That's that's awesome that you're doing better, man. I. I, I tried the local thing for a little while and I was working just as much, if not more locally than I was over the road. And that's one of the reasons I, I've started looking for over the road, uh, a job again. And I came across SPD and 
Yeah, man, it, it, it was the right choice at the right time, and it continues to be the right choice. Um, is there anything that you would like to tell anyone that's watching about the company or – you know, if, if they decide to come over, they can definitely put your name down on an application. Um, and we'll close it out with anything that you would like to add to it. I mean, the, to add, I mean, the company's great. I mean, they treat their drivers amazing and just give it a shot. I mean, what's it going to hurt you to give it a shot and see what it is. I know you hear from other companies the same things, but SPD, they won't lie to you. It's straightforward. They believe in transparency, and they're just an awesome, amazing company. Everybody there. The, the shop, everybody. You can talk to anyone at the, in the company at any time. That's one thing that we really pride ourselves on, and being transparent. Um if you want to know something, it's out there. It's like the driver forums every week that we do on Facebook and the drivers group, we keep the drivers informed of what's going on when it's happening. Um, and there's an open door policy all the way from your fleet manager up to Dan Workula, the president of the company. And yeah, the, you don't have that at, at hardly any place. Well, actually any place I've ever worked. Um, but yeah, it's, Transparency is a very, very big thing here, and the money's good, too. The money's really good. Yeah, and you know another thing, Daniel, that I like about this company that nobody else that I have ever witnessed is all the drivers help each other. That's yes. pretty amazing. You won't find that out of the companies. You're on your own. You know, figure it out by yourself. This company here, every single driver that I've ever ran into has helped me in one way or the other, tarping a load or dropping a load or, you know, anything like that. You know, there's always somebody there to help you. Even in the office, you can call up uh, somebody in the office and get answers, you know, on what you should do with this load or whatever. I think people should just give this a try and they're going to realize, oh yeah, it is true. You know, it's not it's not too good to be true. You know, they're right. actually do they're doing what they say they're going to do. So people need to give it a shot. Right. And I challenge everybody listening to this or watching the video, just pick up the phone and call recruiting. Um, our, yeah. you know, Tom King and Craig Dent that's in there and Kim, they're all drivers that have driven for SPD for a long time. And they're still here, and they're, they they know the culture just as much as we do, and they can answer your questions. If they don't know the answer, they will definitely find the right person to answer it. Um, yeah. Take the challenge, like Mike says. It, you, you're not going to lose anything. Just just give it a shot. And, you know, we, SPD also has uh, a $5,000 sign-on bonus right now with a transition pay, so you're not going to have to miss a paycheck to improve your situation. Um it's definitely worth it. It was, it was for me. And, um, you just heard it from Mike that he said it was definitely worth it for him. So yeah, I, I, I just don't know what else to say. It's definitely worth a shot. Um, yeah, it's worth it. I mean, what do you got to lose? You know? Right. And Mike, uh, stay on the line, but we're going to go ahead and, uh, go ahead and end this little interview. It's going on 10 minutes now. But, um, guys, hit that like, share, and subscribe, subscribe button. If you do decide to come over, uh, write Mike, Mike, Michael Robinson's uh, name down, and uh, you'll definitely be helping another driver, and that's one of the big things that we focus on here at SPD is being one unit and showing support to everyone, just like what we just talked about with the loads. But, anyways, I will see you guys on the next episode. Thanks for tuning in, and we will see you next time.